there, there are a lot of, lot of issues, you know, when it comes to the World Cup being hosted in Africa. But there's just one thing I take from the whole uh, 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 perspective of what people think, the, the perception of uh, uh, what they thought Africa could uh, do, you know, organizing the World Cup. You know, so I, that one thing I took out from there, because when the whole world thought that uh, it was impossible for Africa to host the World Cup, I mean, we did excellent. You know, we organized one of the best World Cup who are going to go down in the history of FIFA. Even Mr. Blatter said that uh, the South African World Cup was one of the best. Uh, don't forget that, uh, like Ambassador George says, there is a lot of pressure also on the African teams and also on the players. But I think there won't be more pressure than playing at home. You know, playing at home, playing in South Africa, I think we probably, uh, um, it was not home ground advantage. Sometimes when you play at home, you think, ah, it's my home ground and we have advantage. I think it added more pressure on the African teams. And I think that this time you see it's more intact and um, a lot of things can happen. You know, though, you know, we are talking now, we, it's still early days, there's six, seven months. Uh, how many months more before the World Cup? So in football in Africa, you know, 24 hours can be a long time also. Uh, but uh, definitely, Africa will be ready and probably it is easier for us to play away from home. Um, I think in South America and Brazil, you know, it will suit us as, as Africans, you know, to, to play well. And um, we're definitely looking forward to the day that's, uh, that a team will go to, to the semifinals and eventually to, to reach the final. We must uh, support all the African teams that are going to go to the World Cup because it's where we, we, we stand together as Africans, you know, uh, going to the World Cup, whether it's with Zambia, whether it's Nigeria, we have to support each other. You know, the competition is over for us, but now there's another competition that the continent is going to represent itself, and then we have to hold together and, and promote each other. We know that there will be other nations against each other, Maybe you never know. I don't know if the, the African team is going to play against each other, maybe in the quarterfinal or semifinal. But now we're going to go in different groups, different uh, 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 zones. So we must you know, talk to those who we can, we can talk to, you know, because we are friends with most of the coaches and most of the players. Talk to them you know, to be very mindful, to be, to, to be focused and uh, because they represent the continent and they will give them our further support because Africa need to, you know, one day win the World Cup. Mm -hmm. You know, we missed the World Cup in 1998, just Senegal, same quarterfinal. We saw Ghana almost were dead in South Africa. But I think uh, there's a possibility, but uh, uh, we need to be focused and we need to push harder. No, very good. Um, uh, the draw is tough. Uh, I'm sure there is also some other teams that are left on the way that would have fancied themselves, you know, to to be in the in the top ten. Uh, the top ten ten teams, you know, uh, we have um, some important games. All big games, no doubt. And I'm sure from those the teams that will lose, they would have fancied themselves to to go to the World Cup. So we're expecting good things from our um, African teams. I think when it happens, um, you're not thinking of recovery. Um, first of all, because you have to pay tribute to the people who have done uh, the country that much. You're young, you're ambitious, and all of a sudden, you know, you see uh, that the team is no longer there. So uh, it was a testing moment uh, for, for Zambia, for everybody that is involved in Zambian football. Um, it's more so for the families of the, um, of the fallen heroes. And... Um, you know, we were all young and we had all one ambition. And that ambition was to go, Zambia had to go to the World Cup or Zambia had to win the Africa Cup of Nations. And so, um, you know, we, we stood still, uh, reflected, there was good decisions made. And um, it was incredible uh, because in that year, after when we started to come back, after we were given, I think, dispensation by FIFA to go back and prepare, um, you know, Zambia did come back and we were, you know, one point away 
from going to the World Cup in 1994, and we also lost in the final to to, to Nigeria after we had scored first in in Tunisia. So. Uh, very close uh, yet so far, but I just want to say that I think it is the resolve of the people. There's I many people to say that they want to come back, but even today, I mean, we, we miss yeah, that team badly and we miss our brothers, um, but they're so rest in peace. Mm -hmm.